Proverbs chapter 9 verses 11 for by me your days will be multiplied and years will be added to your life this is a word of the Lord dear friends today I am celebrating my 39th birthday yesterday parish priest and some of our parish members came home with a cake to celebrate birthday and before cutting the cake they asked me to light the candle I lighted it but after the prayer before cutting the cake they asked me to blow off the candle so this is a customer and you also does the same so all those who were at home I asked them why you asked me to light the candle before the prayer or at the time of the prayer and then you asked me to blow off the candle what's the meaning of this blowing off means that is a negative sign so I should be the light of the world I should blow why should you blow off and everybody have their own stories to tell me but I was not convinced so I started searching what is the real meaning of this and I understood two things the first thing when you blow the candle the smoke will be going up and you are praying so it is a methodological idea of the people from the Greece on you know from the ancient Greek onwards in the smoke our prayer will go to heaven okay that is a good thing so I like it and then why to blow off I, I could not read anywhere anything about that but what I understood blowing off is a sign that you are dead so when I am celebrating my 39th birthday, I should know that 38 years is died in my life. In another word, I must say that in every birthday, there is a death day. Dear friends, you may be celebrating your birthday in a big five-star hotel or seven-star hotel or in a big club and enjoying and being merry. But at the same time, you must remember that your one year is lost in your life. For example, my 2015 is dead and gone. So in every birthday, there is a death day. And since I am aware of that, one year also is lost in my life and I am dead for one year more. I am very cautious about my 2016 for my 40th birthday. I don't have even a minute to waste in coming year. Let, let us manage our days and our time properly to make the coming year a blessing for us and for the nation. May Almighty God bless you.